What's up guys? So we're back. Today we're doing things a bit different. We've seen the athlete side and now we're gonna be introducing you to the coaching side of what I do. Today my girlfriend's here with me, Justine, which was one of the first clients I had shortly after we started going out together. Coaching her for now for about a year. Last year we did a few shows together. We did a regional show which she won the overall and then we went to nationals where she uh, Came this close to winning the pro card, so this year uh, we're doing a show together. I'm going to be doing classic physique and she's going to be doing bikini at the Toronto Pro Qualifier, so we're 10 weeks out, both of us, so today we're going to be running her through a shoulder workout and uh, yeah, hope you guys had a ha happy Easter long weekend, so we're just going to get after it, let's go. Going to have to go through the uh, programs program, here. Program, training program. Ouais, ça fait que tu peux venir ici, John. Puis le faire comme ça. Ah, ok. Mm. Ok, that's fine. No, I can't. It's good start, good start. <laughs> It's too heavy. It's All really right. too heavy for me. Just vite, warm up. Good. So right now it's nothing crazy. Just getting the blood into the shoulders and getting a little pump. You don't want to <sighs> go too close to failure, absolute failure in these. Me too. <laughs> okay. Quebec girlfriend. Huh? She's my Quebec speaking French girlfriend. All right. Okay. Four, cinq, six, come on. Good, good. Uh, good. Oh la la. Honey canes next? Canes. So we're at Pump City today. Our home base. This is where we have our office and we do most of our work with our clients. And this is where I train uh, my clients and Justine does posing with just uh, one pose. It's hard to say, hard to say in English, but uh, yeah, she does a lot of posing in the posing room here. So if any girl or soon to be guys, uh, not soon to be guys, but she's soon to take on guys for posing, but uh, mainly bikini and wellness and figure right now. So if you guys interested, hit up her Instagram page. All right, next set. Let's do it. How many reps? 10. 10? Yeah. Okay. Dude, that's it. Control. Cat up. That's it. Squeeze. That's it. All you just go. Once you need. Here's all. Up. Up. Partial. Don't need. Eight. Good. Okay. That's it. Okay, drop a 12.5. Again. Good. All right, we're getting into it. We're getting into it. Drop set for the pump. All right, let's do it. Okay. Okay. All right. That's it. Yeah, this is the quality. That's it. Set. Here we go. Come on. No. This. Owns. Come on. 13, 14, 8. Okay, it's good. All right. Oof. Drop. Okay, Chris? Yeah. Okay, let's die. Uh, come on. All out, dude. Ah. Four, cat, sink, sis. Let's go. Set. Grit. Ah. Neuf, eight. This. Good. <laughs> All right. Good. Get into the groove. So. What we've been working on for Justine in the last year um, was building a bit more muscle density because that's what she, she was lacking. She was coming like really close to uh, winning her shows and getting the pro card, but she was always off in like the upper glutes and that's what we've been focusing on in her off season. She's actually taken, I guess, the, her first like real off season ever. And uh, I'm pretty excited anyways to see what is hiding under that, you know, 
body fat now. So that we're going to be uh, peeling that off in the next 10 weeks and then seeing what uh, kind of progress we did. So pretty excited about that. And I'm sure a lot of people are excited to see Justine's new version too. Let's impress you with my little <laughs> nugget pump. <laughs> so I'm also sure that a lot of people wanted to see the uh, glute workout today. We're going to kind of be keeping that for the back end of the prep and just uh, do upper body right now because that's important too. Bikini is mostly shoulders and glutes and yeah, we're going to be doing shoulders today. All right, next. All right, so Justine, how did you like my coaching in the last year being in a relationship with uh, me? <laughs> the real hard questions, um, eh? I love it. Come on, no, say I a love, bit more. I love Sam as a coach. <laughs> I hope you love me. Like, I had a big, big difference between my two nationals. Yeah. So, yes, I'm very excited for this year because it's my first off-season. So, and more I lean, more I see muscle than I never had in my life. So, I'm pretty excited of this prep. And to have Seb as a boyfriend? Hmm, good question. <laughs> boyfriend and coach is kind of yeah, hard to... Manage sometimes, but uh, it's love hate relationship. Yeah. I think I think the communication has gotten a lot better, and uh, yeah. with that, the coaching has gotten a lot better mm -hmm. too. So, I think uh, we we've, know each we've, other. we've both done some inner and outer work, and mm -hmm. yeah, it's just getting better. Okay, so 30 is my PR that's for max for how many reps? Your PR, uh, 10? 10, 10? Reps? okay, let's go eight to 10. Time? Yeah. 8 to 10 quality, beautiful reps. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's go. Okay. All right. That's it. Uh. One easy. One. Good. Two. That's it. Beautiful. Three. Four. Come on. All you. Five. Come on. Let's go. Push. Six. Good job. Come on. Seven. Up. All you. Eight. Nine and helping. Let's go. Two more. Nine. Last one. Let's go. And push, 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 push. That's it. Good job. Good. I go good lifting. <laughs> no, that's a good set. That was clean. Oh. That was a clean set. Yeah, but I give all. Yeah, that's good. That's what we want. Top set, you give it all. I give Yeah, and Seb was on prep for like... 10 months now? Well, you were in prep first for 10 months and I have to deal with that. So <laughs> we each had a good taste of our own medicine. Yeah, yeah, so we are on prep together for like more than a year and a half. So yeah. we are very excited for the off season too, just because we can enjoy life and mm -hmm. couple life. But other than that, like we know each other more and more and more. So it helped. And you know my body and you know my character too. And I know him much better. Sorry, my English is not that good. <laughs> That's good. So sometimes I lag. But yeah, so I'm very excited because we're going to live a prep together for the first time. Yeah. So it's pretty exciting. So like when we started dating, essentially like a couple months after that, like two months after that, we started, I started coaching her because she just like left her other coach and whatnot. And then I started coaching her, I think, for six months and you yeah. know she went from her like worst shape ever to probably her best package ever at Toronto yeah. um, in terms of like conditioning fullness and whatnot and then after that we did Vancouver which I think came around like uh, eight to ten months of prep for you and then yeah. I did the same thing which uh, you know did Nationals Arnold's and then that came out to be like ten months too so now that we equally endured each other <laughs> in the same amount of time we're doing our first preps together so i think that's going to be cool for the next yeah, it's very 10, exciting. 10, 10 weeks and when matt and kenny said to seb oh let's do toronto i was like yay first show together and after that i was like hmm, another couple of weeks <laughs> so our, our life has basically been just like prepping and going to the gym and working with clients and coaching so yeah i mean this summer would be a, a nice little um step back from like competing yeah. in the whole thing and just taking a breather but i mean we'll, we'll see when we get there obviously if uh, things change or not 
Yeah, it's going to be your first summer in Montreal too because yeah. you didn't do anything last year. Well, the first time I got here in Montreal, it kind of was a slow summer where I did a couple of festivals, but I didn't really have any work, just kind of like picking stuff up again and yeah, so, it's going to yeah. be fun, be a good time. All right, let's do another set here. Let's go. Ah! Good. Clean press, four, five, up. six. Come on. Eight. Nine. Another one. And ten. Good. Oh. All right. Ooh la la. <coughs> That's my weight, bitch. So, as a girl, we want big glutes, big legs. And when we train upper, it's like we're wasting time. So I don't really like to train my upper, so this is why I train with Seb. Because training my glutes is very easy to have a nice pump, feel my legs, and I feel the growth. But upper is a wasting of time for me, but yeah. We still got to keep the balance from the upper and the lower in the bikini. Yeah. That's essentially what they're looking for is like nice capped out shoulders, not too big. And, and the lower body is kind of, you know, obviously stealing the show with the glutes and the upper glutes and the legs. You know, bikini is starting to be a class where um, it's a very developed physique, but very slim and streamlined. And what we see online is just like up, um, lower body training. So I, we never see like girls training like upper. So this is why we had the idea to just train upper because the only video I saw on Instagram is like how to train glutes. So yeah, we need to work on the delts too. <laughs> yeah, so we can't go really heavy either with Justine or girls. So what I like to do is give them more volume and more of a pump style training with higher reps and drop sets and supersets. So essentially that's what you're seeing today. We're just doing like shoulders, obviously. We usually do back at the beginning of this, but we're short on time today. So we just change things up to you know fit it in our schedule. So. We're finishing up here today with uh, some rear delts as well. Same. See, it's good. Set, that's it. Yeah, that's it. No. See this. Ones. Eight, twos. Good. Ooh, la la. So, I obviously am a form Nazi a little bit when, I'm, when it comes to coaching, but what I do emphasize the most is clients feeling it at the right place without feeling it in the traps or something else that we're trying to not activate. So whatever like movement or position that feels right for them is a position that I will be obviously supporting. So here she's doing it a bit different with her knee on the bench, just obviously because the machine is you know a bit bigger for the smaller girls. So we're just <laughs> making a little adjustments from what you guys have seen me do in the last training. So yeah, yeah, because I'm 4'11". <laughs> <laughs> Almost five. Almost five. Focus, focus, this one. Please, rear delt, that's it. That's it. Isolate, let's go. Good. Squeeze, that's it, good, Aka. Aka, squeeze, Shoulder, shoulders low. Oh, 45 and 46, good. It's like a million reps. Good. Are you good for another one? Okay, it's a good job. That's it. Good. Okay, okay. That's a wrap. You want to go see your uh, posing room? Show them your posing lair. So for those who don't know, I do coaching full-time and Justine does posing coaching for females full-time. 
So she's heavily regarded as the posing queen of Quebec and, you know, <laughs> soon to be uh, North America. <laughs> what? Soon to be like North America, all of Canada. <laughs> so. Okay. So that's how oh I oh, lost the mic. <laughs> but yeah, that's a wrap. Merci that beaucoup. Concludes, so that concludes this episode this week. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And uh, yeah, we're out. So just about, what is it, nine and a half weeks out from Toronto Super Show. Uh, we'll be shooting a workout at the end of the week, closer to nine. And uh, yeah, tag along. We'll be doing this together. Peace out, everybody.